Theater was part of it. And remember, the amphitheater was also part of the original master plan all the way back in 1994 when Chesterfield voters approved the first $11 million bond issue, which created Chesterfield Parks and Recreation. Which, by the way, Chesterfield Parks and Recreation was just accredited earlier this year, one of the first 100 agencies in the nation to be accredited. If I can take a brief moment to just kind of tell you how a project actually works from a, a government agency. Once council uh, authorizes a project, staff develops a scope of work, devel develops a, a, a narrative of what they expect to build, and we send that out to the...